What is going on? Well, well, what? I'm trying to say it. You woke me up. Spill it or I'm going back to bed. I'm pregnant. I'm awake now. Are you sure? Yes, I'm late. How late? Two days. Oh, two days. That's nothing. Last time I was two days late, I had the twins. Last time I was two days late, I had menopause. <laughs> Just trying to lighten the mood. So do you have reason to think that you might be? Well, we try to be safe, but, you know, heat of the moment. Still? After three kids and that beer belly hanging over his pants? Mom? I think you might be getting way ahead of yourself. I'm telling you, I just know. You were also convinced that Georgie was going to be a girl. That's true. Although, he does have very pretty hair. I don't see him. Excuse me, where do you keep your pregnancy tests? Mom. Behind the counter at the pharmacy. Thank you. Would you please be a little more discreet? She doesn't know it's for you. Well, it sure isn't for you. Come on. Ow. <gasps> Go ahead. I can't. Why not? His daughter goes to Missy's school. You are being ridiculous. I don't need the world knowing my business. Okay, fine. Hello. Excuse me. Hi, can I help you? Yes. Uh, I need a pregnancy test. Sure, we have a few options. Hey, Connie. Oh, hey, Brenda. Oh, you you pick. Is that a pregnancy test? Uh, yeah. It's for me. Really? Yes. I come from a long line of really fertile women. My mother had me when she was 57. Can you believe it? I don't think I can. Dr. Sturgis and I have been dating for some time, and we really try to be careful, but you know how it is. Eat of the moment. Hi, Mrs. Cooper. Hi, Billy. Are you playing hide and seek? Oh, yeah. Don't tell anybody. Bye, Mrs. Cooper. Oh, thank you so much. Bye. Wish me luck. You know what you need to do? Yes. How's it going? It'd be a lot easier to pee if you'd stop talking. Sorry. Now it's too quiet. Say something. I know you didn't expect this, and you still might not be, but... But if it turns out you are, I'm here for you. Thanks, Mom. You're not the one I'm worried about. If I'm pregnant, George is going to flip out. I'm sure he would at first. Then he would calm down, take a few beers, maybe some malt liquor. I suppose. The truth is, he and I were both freaked out about having twins, but now I can't imagine life without them. Well, see, there you are. So, no matter what that test says, you're gonna be okay. You're right. What's it say? I'm gonna go buy that malt liquor. 